church just let out. Um, and the gospel uh, was John 35 to 42. And uh, the topic of the sermon was uh, getting oriented. And getting oriented in Christ. And I brought attention to uh, John 141. He first found his brother Simon and said to him, We have found the Messiah, which is translated anointed. Now, you know that there's no love, well, I don't want to say love lost, but that I believe Trump is a wicked man. I even believe there's a possibility that he may be the Antichrist. I want to read from Matthew 25. 23. Then if anyone says to you, look, here is the Messiah, or there he is, do not believe it. For false messiahs and false prophets will appear and produce great signs and omens to lead astray, if possible, even the elect. Messiah, which means anointed. There'll be false people who people will claim are anointed. One of the things that bothers me the most about the apostates who support Trump is they call him anointed by God. They say he's a new Cyrus. They're basically saying that he's the Messiah to bring and to make America Christian again. And Messiah, a savior of Israel. There's only one savior, there's only one Messiah, and that is Jesus Christ. Anything else is heresy and apostasy. The problem is, these people are the loudest. I mean, imagine you're an atheist, and you hear Franklin Graham saying that Trump's election was ordained by God. You know what? If I believed that, I wouldn't be a Christian. If I believed that, I would say, screw this God. I mean, Jesus Christ was a good teacher, but there's no God. If God supports Trump. But I don't believe that. I know better. I have the Word of God. I have the Bible. I have the Holy Spirit. And I know better. I, I know my shepherd's voice. A thief is trying to steal the flock and might possibly even the elect, if that was possible. So, if you're watching this, and if you're still a Trump supporter, and if you still say, I can't lay hands or speak against the one anointed by God. I never will speak against the one anointed by God. I will never speak against Jesus Christ. But I do speak against Trump because he's not an anointed one. He's not a Messiah. And anyone who supports and says that he's a Lamb of God or a Messiah or the anointed one, they are the false prophets. God bless.